Katie Hopkins has had her Australian visa cancelled after making reckless comments about flouting quarantine rules. Katie Hopkins, 46, has had her Australian visa cancelled after she filmed herself boasting about breaching hotel quarantine rules. On Monday, Home Affairs Minister Karen Andrews made the cancellation announcement, which followed a decision by Endemol Shine Australia to end her contract to appear on Seven Network's Big Brother VIP. Hopkins will now be required to leave the country. It comes after she broadcast a live video from what she claimed was a Sydney hotel room on Saturday morning, describing COVID-19 lockdowns as the greatest hoax in human history and undermining the hotel's safety protocols. She also joked to her 262 Kelvin's Instagram followers of elaborate plans to breach quarantine rules. In the video that has since been deleted. She spoke about lying in wait for room service by the hotel door so she can spring it open and frighten the s asterisk asterisk t out of them and do it naked with no face mask. That's one game that I am playing, she said while laughing. Current rules require all those in hotel quarantine to wear a mask and wait 30 seconds after their food has been delivered before opening their door to collect it, so as to minimize both direct contact and aerosol transmission. Hopkins' actions sparked outrage. With the government condemning her behaviour and Australians stranded overseas demanding to know how she secured a place in quarantine. On Monday, Andrews described her behaviour as shameful and said it is a slap in the face for all those Australians who are currently in lockdown. Yesterday I directed Australian Border Force to immediately consider the facts of this matter and urgently review whether this individual is complying with the requirements of her visa. Ms Andrews said in a statement, Border Force have been responding to that overnight and continue to do so today. It is despicable that anyone would behave in such a way that puts our health officials and community at risk, she said. She continued to tell ABC News Breakfast, the fact that she was out there boasting about breaching quarantine was appalling.